Hi guys, what's going on today? It's Joel from JFP Automotive. Going to show you this update on this 2008 Volvo C30. The car's been here for a while. Um, this has been a project that we've been working on slowly and now we're finally going to get things nailed together on it. Um, customer brought it in. He wanted to get, uh, well, look at the sheet over here. We still got this. This was the build sheet from the customer. Uh, we wanted 450 wheel horsepower, 450 wheel torque. So, sized up a uh, full build on the engine. Um, we did dart and sleeves, fully built bottom end, cams. The whole engine has been reworked, redone. Um, well over 600 wheel horsepower is what this thing will hold. We got a Garrett GT36 turbo, which is sitting on the shelf over here, because we are going to get the top of it powder coated. And I think you can see it right there. I don't know if that'll turn out. You can cut that out if that doesn't look like any good. So here's the car. It has got this gorgeous blue color paint job on it. Um, we've got the Elevate intake manifold on it. Um, we've adapted to a GM LS throttle body so we can get lots of airflow through this. Um, Turbo is going to be top mount, sit right here. Um, just a log style manifold on the back of the engine there. We are converting this to all wheel drive. So this is a full drivetrain out of a Volvo S60. So we are going to take all of this stuff and slam it into this. We're going to get a hull dex controller for the rear diff so that we can control the rear differential, the all wheel drive on the fly. We also have done a half cage in it. Got some grassroots racing seats. Uh, we still got to put the interior back together, but this will be a full interior and full cage car. We're also going to be upgrading the rear brakes. It has, still has the stock brakes on it right now, um, but we're going to be doing a dual caliper bracket as well as um, upgrading the front brakes to a much larger uh, four pot brake system on the front as well. So that's the update on this right now. We've had GT Customs uh, do up the radiator in the front, the front mount intercooler. They did a really nice job out front here. And we'll show you some dress up stuff that we'll be doing to this stuff later on as well. But this is just a little update. We're getting the all wheel drive conversion done right now. You guys got any questions, comments, like and subscribe us and post any questions you got in the comments. So thanks guys.